Hey, what's up guys? Hope you're all having a wonderful day so far. So in today's video on how to go from zero to hundred thousand dollars using an AI web agency business model. So this is episode eight. We'll be quickly going over the pricing for your business, creating an offer and all those things. So just in shorts, while well, we'll be creating an offer, pricing options, once off and monthly options, payment processing, invoicing, business registration, how and when to register. So firstly, for your offer, I would recommend that you uh, remove the risk completely by working upfront. Uh, you'll just basically be showing them the design. It is AI generated, so uh, it won't really take you more than 10 minutes. Then you just slap on their logo, and then you can already show them a full, uh, well, potential design for their website. Obviously, once you get the sale, uh, once, well, they actually pay you, then just put in like a few hours, just make it personal, personalized and just improve the website for them. Um, so yeah, but the main thing is, so you, you should remove the risk completely uh, for them so they can actually trust you. And by, by doing that is just by showing them the design that you already made for them. Then they know you're serious. You can actually, um, provide what you are offering them and remember to sell them value, uh, sell, well, tell them how it will increase their business through just more revenue, being the authority in their city or the area, especially if they are at the top of the Google search rankings. And by well, building them a great site, by doing all these things that will be going through over, it will automatically boost their sites to the top of the rank, uh, well, to the top of the Google rankings, automating their reviews, getting them a bunch of reviews. Just focus by selling them value, not just a website, some unnecessary expense. You can also tell them by getting a website, it will get them more clients. Even if it's only just one or two extra clients in the beginning per month, it basically already paid for the entire website already. And then, uh, well, they will get more reviews, they will get more traffic, and then it will be getting them lots of extra clients. In so, uh, well, it will put them in a place where they can be the authority of whatever industry or niche they are in, in their area. Let's say they are a lawyer firm. In time, they will be the lawyer firm with the most reviews. And if someone just searches law business or something like that, then they will come up at the very top and they will obviously be getting more clients and they will be the most trusted uh, law firm in their area. So for pricing, I recommend that you start low and once off for your first few clients to build a portfolio for yourself and uh, to increase your trustworthiness and to understand the whole business model, uh, to, well, to understand the whole business model, you should focus on the long term, well, on a long term approach for a business, not just short term, just getting and charging as much as you can. Start by just uh, getting a few clients, don't overcharge them, just make it a no brainer offer to get a few clients. And then later on, once you have more experience, you have a bigger por portfolio, then you can actually just start by selling while well, charging a lot more for your price well, for your product. And then always find out how a potential, in the, well, once you start talking to a client, always find out how a potential client's business is doing and then offer them a price based on that information. If they are do, saying they are doing incredible, they are making all this money, obviously then you can charge them a higher price compared to someone or a business that's just a startup. So charge them high prices to make them consider, well, and you can also, um, well, once you get to the offer point, point uh, once you have also have a few clients, you can offer them, charge them a quite high once off price if you want to get them to pay you uh, monthly retainers. Let's say, um, uh, let's say you charge them a quite high number, then you can make a much lower monthly installment plan or just a monthly retainer. So they just keep on paying. And then in that offer, you can, in the monthly plan, you can obviously offer them, uh, well, if I just go down here, web hosting, maintenance and updates if they ever need any updates to their website and most service based businesses like accountants, lawyers, uh, barbershops, all those basically all types of businesses, not an e-commerce business, not someone who sells specific products, specifically physical products on their website, just like a normal business. They won't really be doing too much updates on their website. They won't be adding a bunch of products, adding a bunch of services every single day. If they want an update, it'll most likely just change. Well, they would just request that you change a photo or maybe the, the address or something like that. Just go back, oh, back up. Um, well, just for example, um, well, in the beginning, maybe charge like five hundred dollars if you're in US, South Africa, like two thousand rand. Then for your next client, charge them a thousand, five thousand, some somewhere in between that, and then obviously then continue increasing the prices once you find the well the perfect spots. And uh, depends on the industry you are. If they can afford it, some uh, industries are doing really well. Then you can obviously charge them a lot more. But I highly recommend in the beginning just get a few clients. Let's charge them a low fee. Just get a few clients, and then later on you can start by charging retainers and um, offering your pre-existing clients uh, additional services like well these in the bottom 
then you can obviously, well, just build monthly retainers, but you can only do that if you have a happy client. So especially in the beginning, don't overcharge your clients, get a, well, just get some clients, get the business up and running, get some capital in your business, and then you can obviously invest in, well, growing your business, maybe hiring someone, maybe outsourcing a few things and just stuff like that and maybe maybe running ad spends and and stuff like that. well ads for your uh, for your business but just sending them to a landing page and offer uh, like i showed you in i believe video three um the website is called uh, the free website guys they are getting to, well you can check they are do, uh, getting two hundred thousand traffic a month and just but well their offer is they will sh uh, design your website for free keep in word Keep in mind the word is design. They were like, what I, what I, exactly like I told you guys earlier, you, uh, you can get, show them a design and the design is AI generated. And then once they are happy, obviously then you just put in a bit more work and then you actually give them their website after you have received a payment. So always remember you're not just a web design company, not just one of those boring web design companies. You're basically a software company because you, you do a whole bunch of other things as well. You can, you, well, firstly, well, the, the most obvious one, you offer them web hosting and maintenance and updates, uh, most likely on a retainer. Um, you can, well, charge them in time as a retainer as well. You can also help them with their, with high Google rankings, SEO, uh, just by, well, automating their reviews, uh, while well, just adding geotaggings in the photos and stuff. Well, I'll show you that in later videos. And just by using Airify on its own, they will already be uh, ranking higher and higher every single day. Uh, just because while well, the website is well already um, it's it's created in a way that will uh, enable it to be ranked higher on Google, and then you can also offer them review automation on Google and Facebook. It's just a simple automation that you can do in Airify that will once a customer well once the business receives a customer automatically will email them a review well just a form to um, well just give you a review on Google and on Facebook, and it will also automate it can also automatically reply. And then that will that will really help um, while well, getting them more clients because they will be the most reviewed business in their area, and they will it will also greatly uh, boost their Google rankings. So it will also get them more clients and more traffic. And that's just the basic automation that you can do. And once it is uh, once you have set it up, you are basically well. Then it's done. Then the software works on its well works for itself, and uh, you can also charge monthly retainers and all these things. Uh, you can also offer them booking automation plus confirmation on both sides. Let's say you're a barbershop, um, well, your client is a barbershop or a hair salon, whatever. Uh, you can automate their bookings by just having a uh, well, a calendar link that Airify also creates for them. And then once the client, well, the barbershop's clients actually books that specific time, then automatically by just using automation again on Airify, then it will send a email to both the business and the client. Your well, you can change the text, but it will can it will basically say something like your um, your book your booking at hair salon or premium hair salon, whatever the name is, is on that day that specific time, and send it. Well, it will send to both the client and the business, and then obviously you can set up reminders as well, like a day out, twelve hours out, so no one misses. Uh, well, no one forgets about the booking. And just, well, you can automate that whole process as well. And then obviously you can run ads for them as well. And that's, well, that's relatively simple, um, but I'll show you that later on. But I would recommend that in the beginning, don't bombard your potential clients with all these different things. Start out by just saying, okay, boom, I can, uh, we can help you with this amazing website that will increase your, your authority in your area that will, um, that will get you more clients that will, well, just focus on just the web creation part. And then later on, once you have a happy client, you can well tell them about, hey, we actually have all these other services as well uh, that we, um, well, we can show, we can set it up for you for free. And then if they like it, then you can just charge a small monthly retainer. And then, well, you can end up building a big portfolio and it's 100% aut automatic once this is, well, the, this, well, these things are, it's just a bit of software that you just enable on the Airify app. And then once it is up and running, you don't really have to do anything. So um, you can really build up, build yourself up a very nice, uh, well, let's, let's call it, well, a monthly retainer or passive income, but it's not really passive income because you still have to do every now and then a bit of work, maybe just check on your clients and stuff like that. But you can build a very nice monthly retainer for yourself and have, 
well to be honest hundreds of them because it is software it's not a day well it's not work yet that you have to put in every single day if you just put on the software correctly and the automations then it is running for you